Hey, what is up guys? Welcome back to another YouTube video at the world of AI. In today's video, I'm going to be showcasing RealChart, which is basically your own personal AI assistant. Now, RealChart is an advanced AI powered virtual character that goes beyond simple chatbot interactions. It has been meticulously designed to engage in meaningful conversations, provide relevant information, and even express emotions, aiming to create a highly immersive and lifelike human computer interaction. Now, at its core, RealChar utilizes the cutting edge natural language processing algorithms and machine learning models to understand and interpret user input. It has different types of encoders as well as decoders to computate different types of generation of context that can be even outputted with voice using different APIs. Now it can comprehend complex queries, context, uh, different things that allow for a natural and interactive conversation. And this ability is to basically grasp the intent behind the actual user's message, which enables real charts to provide more of an like an accurate as well as a contextual relevant response. So in today's video, I'm just going to showcase what real chart is actually able to accomplish, what you can actually do with it, taking a look at the demo. Can also showcase some of the features the architecture and i'm also going to showcase how you can actually install it locally on your computer and there's actually a live demo that is available on the cloud so i'll also go through this demo so that you can see some of the capabilities of this amazing application so with that thought guys it would mean the whole world to me if you guys can go to the world of ai on the twitter page and follow it if you guys haven't already i'm going to be posting the latest ai content over here so you're up to date with this news on the ai world and if you guys haven't subscribed already it would mean the whole world to me if you guys can do so i'm going to be posting the latest ai videos over here so definitely stay tuned subscribe turn the notification bell like this video and comment anything you want to see in the future now if you guys haven't seen any of my previous videos i highly recommend that you do so there's a lot of content and a lot of value that you'll definitely benefit from so definitely give this uh view if you guys haven't and with that thought let's get right into the video so recently these ai assistant applications have been actually popping off they've been gaining a lot of popularity there's actually an ai companion app that was gaining a lot of attraction recently but the thing about this it's really good it's also a really good ai app but the reason why i'm covering real char over this app is because this has an integrated voice feature in which you can have a text-to-speech or a speech-to-text feature in which you can talk and have your AI assistant function in. And this has way more capabilities and features that the AI companion app doesn't have. I'm not saying this is a horrible app. I'm saying this is good, but this is just better in my opinion. But basically, RealChar also goes beyond in basically giving more information it has been programmed to understand and express it. now guys as we go further on into the video as we look at the demo we're gonna see that these AI assistants are able to replicate very human-like expressions body languages as well as vocal annotations and this is because real char can convey a wide range of emotions such as joy sadness surprise or even empathy these emotional intelligence enhances the actual user experience to actually create a stronger sense of connection and engagement with your own personal ai agent you're able to see you can even have different types of uh replications of famous people you have elon musk here as your own ai assistant which is very cool uh and like basically it offers a high degree of customization and you as a user can basically have the ability to personalize the ai's character as well as the appearance that they have you can change their personality traits background and even the voice that represents it now this customization feature is going to allow you as a user to shape real char into a virtual character that aligns with your own preferences and needs. It adds to the personal touch of your own AI assistant, making it more human like and the interactions basically become more meaningful and enjoyable when you work with these AI agents. Now, RealChar's versatility also extends to its adaptability across different platforms. Now, it seemingly has been integrated with web-based applications, terminal environments, and even mobile devices through an open source mobile app. And the great thing about this application, guys, it is completely free. It is open source and you're able to work upon this and keep building upon this. And it just shows how amazing this 
app will be as well as how they will actually develop this in the future. Now, in terms of its architecture, let us talk a little bit more about how it actually operates. So Realchar evolves with the latest advancements in this field, basically by utilizing the different frameworks and models such as OpenAI, uh, you have Claude 2, you have Chroma, Whisper, Eleven Labs for the voice API, and many more, which you can see in this architecture right over here, this framework. And it's basically to deliver the most up-to-date and cutting-edge AI capabilities for you when you operate this application. And basically, you start off with the data preparation, you have a character data, and that is set with the LLM, which is ChatGPT in this case. It is the prompt that is used to create the character's chat log, and that is utilizing Llama Index. And in this case, there's a voice clone that utilizes the Eleven Labs API. So this is how the actual voice is being out inputted into the actual system. And through this, it goes to a vector database, which is Chroma. And then it is utilized to actually store the interactions as well as the memory. And from this, it uses an LLM. In this case, it utilizes Langchain's abilities to have the output of a text-to-speech. And you're able to get this outputted into a web, mobile, or even a terminal as an output for the text-to-speech. And you can also have uh, just text to text, you can have text to speech, speech to text, and these are some of the things and capabilities of this application. And obviously, over here, you have a web mobile terminal that can input a certain speech, a speech to text, and this is then sent to the LLM. And then you're able to have these interactions stored with different databases. And this is basically how this functions. There, you can see there's so many different types of cutting edge AI applications that are being used for this application and it just showcases how integrated as well as how seemingly it is basically flowing from the start to finish. Now let us take a look at the key features before we actually take a look at how you can actually install it. We see it is easy to use. There is actually no need for code. It eliminates the need for coding skills, which makes it so much more accessible for a wide range of users. You can create your own AI character without the actual requirement of any programming knowledge, which enables for an effortless setup and customization. You're also moving on to the next feature, which is customize. Uh, customizable like features which are basically showcasing that Realchar offers extensive customization options which allows you as a user to have your own AI become something that you want it to be. You can have your own personality with the AI assistant and different background and even their own specific voice that you would want to have it output. And this level of customization enhances the experience for you and enables you to actually tailor the character for your own specific needs and preferences. Thirdly, there's a real-time feature which is for your real-time interaction with the AI assistant. You can engage in real-time conversations with your AI character, whether it's through speech or even messaging. You're able to utilize this feature on this application because of this. There's a multi-platform you can have you can utilize this app on the web, mobile, or in even terminal. You are also given the feature of having this open source, so you can tweak it, add on with it, and access it for completely free. Now, there's many other features that are hidden within the actual application, and this is something that you will get a better idea of as you start using it or start playing around with it. You can see over here, there's comparisons with existing applications. You have its open source, you have an open mic conversation, you have custom all characters, uh, you can customize the voice and appearance, and you can have it supported on multiple different platforms. Whereas many of these other like applications that are similar to Realchar cannot do all the same things that Realchar can. Now, in terms of the installation process, there is a tutorial that is set up over here. I'm just going to be showing the demo, but in this case, it's fairly easy to set up. You're going to need an open API token key. You will need to prepare an LLM. Obviously, this is an optional, but in my case, if you want the best output of generated content, I would highly recommend that you add this. And if you want a speech text, obviously, you'll need your cloud, Google Cloud API and 11 labs to have the actual speech output it to you and this is something that all you all the things that you will need to prepare now in terms of installation you will need to have python installed as well as git to help clone the repository onto your desktop you start off with this command 
and this is for Mac, but for you, you're, if you're using Windows, you'll need to install the different things for the application. Once you're done, you'll need to install Python requirements. And obviously, as you go forward, you just need to copy and paste these commands into your actual terminal. And in case of setting up the end file, you will need to input your different keys that you want to play around with. If you're going to be using the open API key, you can input this. You will need to put this. It's 100% required. And the 11 labs key is 100% required. 11 labs actually has a thousand tokens that are completely free. So you can utilize this free option. And I highly recommend that you play around with this. There's other text to speech uh, API keys that you can utilize. But in my personal opinion, I definitely believe that 11 labs is way better. Now, I highly recommend that you check this out. If you guys haven't, get the key. There's a free tutorial I actually made on my uh, video. There's the 11 labs video. So if you guys want to get a better idea of how you can get the API key, definitely watch that video. So once you have inputted your API keys in the .n file, you can basically get rid of the example and that is behind the end and save it. And you can run it with the server by typing this Python command and you'll be able to run it on your local host once that is ready. And it's fairly easy. You have an installation via Docker as well. So you can utilize Docker as well to set this up. But in our case, we're just gonna use the cloud version, which you can see and play around with the demo. So once you click on the website, you have an option to select an output, audio output. In this case, I'm gonna be using an audio input for my mic, and that is gonna be the Yeti stereo microphone that I'm using right now. So I can click connect and you can talk or you can text with many of these different types of features obviously if you want to customize it you will need to download it locally on your desktop but for the sake of this video i'm just going to be showcasing a demo of these different ai assistants now i'm going to use elon musk because i love him <laughs> i'm going to talk to him now if you want to say something you can talk to elon hi elon what is real char and when you're ready you can hang this up Oh, sorry, not hang this up. Hi, Elon. What is the purpose of real char? And then you just click on, I believe, this. One sec, guys. Okay, guys, I figured of it out. Of course, please go ahead and ask your question or provide more context, and I'll do my best to help you out. So what you can do is you click on this call button. Hi, Elon. What's the purpose of real char? Once you inputted your thing, you just have to click close and it will then start responding. Hi there. I believe you're referring to my statement about the importance of having a good heart. The purpose of emphasizing someone's good heart is to highlight the significance of empathy, compassion, and ethical behavior in the pursuit of innovation and pro So he just said something completely different from what I asked, obviously because the AI does not know what real char is, but if you want to ask something more common it will actually output it so let me think about something uh let's say uh who is the founder of twitter let's just ask that hi elon who is the founder of twitter the founder of twitter is jack dorsey he co-founded the platform in 2006 which is completely correct now you can even keep chatting or if you want you can just even have a text to actual text to speech which is way more easier and you get a better output though i'm gonna go and have it selected as a text you can have different ai character helper in this case hi friend what brings you over here hello what is real char let's send a message Okay, in this case, I don't think I'm getting the best answer, but let me go back, go with Elon, text him. So Hello, I'm, I'm not familiar with the term real char. Could you please provide more context or clarify what you mean? So in this case, I'm pretty sure because this is a new application, so the AI is not going to know what it is. But let's say, uh, what is the purpose of life? Let's ask it something like this. Uh, the purpose of life, a profound question indeed. A pauses. In my view, the purpose of life is to find inspiration, to pursue what excites and fulfills us. It's about pushing the boundaries of what's possible, exploring new frontiers, and making a positive impact on the world. Smiles, what inspires you? <laughs> 
So if you hear that, it actually says something in the bracket when it's supposed to actually visualize it. So this is one thing that I believe is an error at this current moment and they're going to continuously work on this. So that's something cool that I just caught, but we can see that you're able to chat and have your own personal assistant. Now, imagine if you're able to use this and utilize it for your own purpose, you can customize it's open source. So that means you can have it accustomed to your own preference. So if you have a business or some sort of like secretary you can like function it so that it can respond to certain things and have it as your own personal agent so it just showcases that you're able to have your own personal ai agent that can do anything that you ask it and you can basically have life real life conversations with your own ai bot now as technology gets better you're going to have real-time conversations with this where you don't have to send a message where you can just constantly talk with them as it continuously listens for you and with you. So with that thought, guys, I hope you found that Real Char is a remarkable real-time AI character app. It's going to be amazing as to how they innovate and work on this application. So definitely keep an eye out for this. And with that thought, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. I really, really appreciate it. It mean the whole world to me if you guys can go give World of AI a follow if you guys haven't already. I'm going to be posting the latest AI news here, so definitely give this a follow. So, and if you guys haven't subscribed, definitely do so. Turn on the notification bell, like this video, and comment anything you want to see in the future uploads. So with that thought, guys, I highly appreciate it for you guys watching. It means the whole world to me if you guys can subscribe, guys, and share it with your friends if you guys haven't already. And with that thought, make sure you spread positivity, have a smile, and I'll see you guys very shortly. Peace out, fellas.